Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Legend of Mana with me, Kinda Sky. Last we left off, we helped out, well, we helped out the male lady and we took care of these little sorcerers here and now they're our apprentices. We will talk to them at another time. I'm not gonna make them part of my team or anything, so don't worry about it. Just don't. Just really don't. Alright, I'm gonna talk to my cactus friend here. Be like, hey, what's up? Yo, I got another story to tell you. Scary pumpkins! Yes, they were really scary, especially the one that almost blew up my face. But there he goes, he's gonna log in. Uh, if you guys are interested in what he's talking about in his little diary, let me know in the comment section and I will show them off. But I'm really not interested in doing them. They're not part of my little plot here. Uh, so, I'm going to just continue on with the next event for this episode. Uh, this time we are going to go to back to Domina, actually. I almost forgot where I was going, because there's there's going to be a lot of things going on here. Um, first off, we're going to go back to Domina, and we're going to go back to where we were before, where little sorcerers took over, because the field will be completely different. So, let's get started. This one will be a lot of fun, though, I promise. It'll be interesting to watch me do this. Trust me. It's gonna be real quick, though. So, this will be a quick little video. Little snippets. You people might like this anyway. This is probably one of the uh, different LPs that you guys seen. This is technically also a walkthrough. So people don't have to look and see, Oh no, where's everything at? I don't know what part is what. So, I'm making different parts the events, so... Look, a monster egg! Dun 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 dun! Uh, it's a beast egg. You never see wild eggs around here. Quite lucky you are. This is a rare opportunity. Try to catch it. Uh... Um, what's an egg? It's just a baby right now, but someday it'll grow to up to be a big monster. Of course most monsters hate people, so they try to harm us. But a monster raised from youth learns to protect its master. So what's a beast egg? Beast is a type of monster that will be that it will become. You can't really tell exactly what monster it will grow up to be. They all look the same, but if you look closely, you can tell what class a monster belongs to. With some practice, you can th differentiate between over ten types of monsters. Wow! So we're gonna try and catch this one. Not so fast. You can't just haphazardly walk up to an egg. They are watching you. It's like shelter from Garfield and friends. <laughs> Go carefully and try to catch them off guard. Uh, carefully? First of all, don't stand in front of it. You'll only scare the poor thing. When scared, monster eggs run away at incredible speeds. Next, keep your eyes on the egg. That way, you'll be able to tell what the egg is thinking. Uh, off guard? Monster eggs are gluttons. They forget everything once they start munching. And when they're full, they fall asleep. Then they'll be a lot easier to catch. And try to stay out of the egg's field of vision. They'll think you've gone away and you can catch them off guard. So, we can do this then. Try using this. He's gonna give us dice berries. These are all like foods. Bell grapes, citrus squid. Uh, so open the food selection list with the triangle button and drop it with the X button. I'll say it again. You can open the food selection list with the triangle button. And we unlocked an event. Monster Crown. So, uh, this here, it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, you'll find these rare occurrences where you'll find these eggs out in the middle of nowhere. Um, well, there's no animal meat here. I don't know what he's gonna eat then. How about a dice berry? It's like an Ichigo. Ugh. Come on! Fine. I'll look away. Fine, what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna take this back. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put the dice bear here. Get it closer. Out of field of vision. And we are going to get it! Beast egg is mine. Delivery will be well to, this, to the corral I go, and then she's gonna go and take my egg. Of course! Relax, Pelican will deliver the egg to the corral. Well, we better get head to the corral too. Yeah, I guess we should. And however, we magically appear at the corral. This is actually part of my home. Here we are, at the backyard of, of your home. This is the monster corral. You can let up the three monsters graze. Monsters will level up when you leave them grazing here. They'll grow up to become reliable partners for your journey. The 
monster eggs that you caught are in that barn. So let's go take a look at the barn. Also, uh, for those who are interested, you can acquire a chocobo in this game. There are lots of ways to get one, but the hardest one is actually getting it in this game. The easiest way is if you have a, um, a saved data version of Final Fantasy. One of the Final Fantasy games, I think it was 7 or 8, I can't remember, but if you have one of them, you can get the chocobo quite easily. So this is where we raise the monster you catch and they feed here and whatever. You might find a monster egg during your adventure. Capture an egg when you find one. You can have up to five pets. If you already have five pets and you find another egg, you can sell either the egg or one of the five pets you already have. Sell the one that you don't really like. Jennifer at the item shop will buy the eggs from you. She can be a tight one, but she's the only buyer around. Anyway, eggs hatch in a few days. Monsters become attached to their master and like to follow along. They grow more powerful by gaining experience. They can become great adventuring partners. Oh yeah, monsters' growth is affected by diet. Try feeding them different food to see what happens. Monsters will only eat when they gain a level, so you must let them graze or take them out for them to eat. Now you know what to do. How the monster grows up is up to you. Well then, and he's off. So our egg is going to be hatching. It'll take days for it to hatch, but that's the end, Monster Corral. Hopefully we'll we'll see what we get. Maybe it might be the rabbit on the screen, but who knows?